Aldehyde oxidase, Wikipedia article audio. Aldehyde oxidase is a metabolizing enzyme, located in the cytosolic compartment of tissues in many organisms. AO catalyzes the oxidation of aldehydes into carboxylic acid, and in addition, catalyzes the hydrosylation of some heterocycles. It can also catalyze the oxidation of both cytochrome P450 and monoamine oxidase intermediate products. AO plays a very important role in the metabolization of numerous drugs. AO catalyzes the conversion of an aldehyde in the presence of oxygen and water to an acid and hydrogen peroxide. Reaction Species Distribution Though the enzyme uses molecular oxygen as an electron acceptor, the oxygen atom that is incorporated into the carboxylate product is from water, however, the exact mechanism of reduction is still not known for AO. The AO also catalyzes the oxidation of heterocycles, which involves a nucleophilic attack located at the carbon atom beside the heteroatom. This means that susceptibility to nucleophilic attack of a heterocycle determines if that heterocycle is a suitable substrate for AO. Aldehyde oxidase is a member of the molybdflavoprotein family and has a very complex evolutionary profile as the genes of AO varies according to animal species. Higher primates, such as humans, have a single functioning AO gene whereas rodents have four separate AOX genes. The human population has both functionally inactive HAOX1 allelic variants and encoding enzyme variants with different catalytic activities. AO activity has been found to be much more active in higher primates, though many factors may affect this activity, such as gender, age, cigarette smoking, drug usage, and disease states. Aldehyde oxidase is very concentrated in the liver, where it oxidizes multiple aldehydes and nitrogenous heterocyclic compounds, such as anti-cancer and immunosuppressive drugs. Some AO activity has been located in other parts of the body including the lungs, the kidneys, and the gastrointestinal tract. The regulation of expression of AO is still not completely known though some studies have shown that the AOX1 gene is regulated by the NRF2 pathway. Some known inhibitors of AO are sterol and phenol compounds, like estradiol. Others include amsacrine, 6,6-azipurine, chlorpromazine, cimetidine, cyanide, diethylstilbestrol, genestein, isovanillin, and methadone. Tissue distribution AO is very similar in amino acid sequence to xanthine oxidase. The active sites of AO has been found to have a superimposed structure to that of EXO, in studies involving mouse liver. AO is a homodimer, and requires fat, molybdenum, and 2,2-Fe2S clusters as cofactors. These two 2-Fe2S cofactors each bind to the two distinct 150 keta monomers of AO. Three separate domains harbor these three requirements. There is a 20 keta N-terminal which binds to the two 2-Fe2S cofactors, a 40 keta domain which provides a means of binding to the FAD, and a C-terminal which houses the molybdenum. Aldehyde oxidase is thought to have a significant impact on pharmacokinetics. AO is capable of oxidizing many drugs in the liver, because of its broad substrate specificity. AO greatly contributes to the hepatic clearance of drugs and other compounds. For example, cytoplasmic AOX1 a key enzyme in the hepatic phase I metabolism of several xenobiotics. For this reason, AOX genes are becoming increasingly important to both understand and control in the therapeutic drug industry. 
Pfizer TLR7 agonist program has found several techniques to switch the AO metabolism off. Regulation Structure Role in drug metabolism an aldehyde and H2O and O2 a carboxylate and H2O2 plus H plus.